first time ko uh, mag-check-in sa bagong international airport ng Cebu uh, before our flight. So I'm gonna give you some uh, some simple tips if it's your first time to have an international flight. Touchdown Korea! Oh, sorry. Gana gana. See ya. One, two, three. What's Wait. up? Hello, <laughs> kita. <laughs> What's up? What's up? Hello, mga happy feet. Welcome back to another vlog here in my channel. And if you're new here, please be a part of my happy feet family by subscribing and clicking the bell button. So right now, guys, it's 5 a.m. in the morning and. We are bound for Mactan Cebu. Did I want to die? Korea. Upa. Upa. See you in Cebu, guys. Bye bye. The location of the nearest exit. So guys, kakarating lang namin sa airport. Gindala ko na lang ako ng trench coat. Gina-carry ko na lang sa akin. In case magabot kami sa Incheon Airport. Nga tugnaw, may suksoko na ko. So guys, kaya gusto ko sa Shonggang. Gusto ko sa Shonggang. Gusto ko sa Shonggang. Gusto ko sa Shonggang. Hi guys, update lang. It's already 12 noon. And first time ko... Uh, mag-check in sa bagong international airport ng Cebu. Tara, let's go na. Mag-check in na tayo. Hi, guys! Hi! So, just a quick glimpse, guys, of what the interior of the new Cebu International Airport looks like. Grabe! Pati yung CRC Airport is Blanca Bells. Guys, so we are So, we have some fresh and Guys, sorry, I'm as a stand ng camera. Ko. So, yun guys, we have one hour uh, before our flight. So, I'm gonna give you some, some simple tips if it's your first time to have an international flight. So first thing for first things first na gagawin niyo is um, magbayad kayo na international travel travel tax which is fixed na yan guys na 1620. So pwede ka mag-pay online sa designated na airline online services ng travel tax mo. But I think they have uh, online fee na 100 pesos ata. And the next thing after travel tax is you have to check in your luggage if meron ka. If not, just get your boarding pass lang sa ano, check-in counter. You ha just have to present your um, international travel, travel tax receipt. After mo na makuha yung boarding pass mo, um, you have to pay an international domestic fee na 850 pesos. So after terminal fee, pwede ka na mag-fill up ng iyong departure card para for the immigration. So, you'll just have to fill in the details ng nasa sa departure card. So, yun na nga guys, after ng departure card, ilagay mo na together with your boarding pass, your passport, plus yung mga supporting documents nyo na voucher sa hotel, um, mga entrance tickets nyo sa mga amusement parks, sa mga attractions, like mga club vouchers, yan guys. Then, you know, you're good to go for immigration. So, yan guys, it's just a simple tips lang for sa mga for first timers na mag international flights. So, bye! Gaya ko! <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
So, we are going to immigration guys after we are going to go to the plane. Currently, it's 9.20 here in South Korea. But the one hour is in advance and the temperature is 2 degrees, which is good now. So, good luck to you guys. Hi So we have to transfer going to Terminal 1. Kailangan pa namin mag ng MTR. Yan guys, latest update. It's already 1 a.m. ng umaga. And tayo na kami di sa nga Airbnb. Nakap na yawan pa kami pangita tapos tugangan mga super tugnaw tugnaw we just so we decided nga from exit 2 sang amon sang MTR nga lapit sa amon nagkuha na lang kami taxi anyways guys ma rest kami ana because we have a uh, busy day ahead daw kami ulo brown bus daw kami dalagawan so bus na lang kamo i room tour sa amon nga Airbnb Pero muna siya, muna Katrin. This is our room. Basta, i-room tour ko kamo. So, bye-bye! Uh, watch out for my next vlog. Sa so, official day one, na am on sa Korea.